in some projects the duct bedding or duct cross breaking you can find it used in uh, duct fabrication process this can give it extra rigidity for the duct however it have certain applicability range as we can see here as obtained from smacna this is a photo of the duct bedding and this is a photo of the duct cross breaking cross breaking of the duct you can find it easily in a lot of places because as we said it gives the duct more rigidity however you can see that smacna have given some notes in here duct sizes of 19 inch wide and larger which have more than 10 square feet of unbedded panels shall be bedded or cross-sectioned unless duct wall have insulation covering or acoustic liner the requirement is applicable to 20 gauge or less thickness and three water gauge or less it's unnecessary to break or bed all sides unless each duct dimension requires it so the summary of this is that you are allowed to do the duct breaking or duct bedding unless you have insulation on the duct from the outside or inside because this will uh, create air bubbles or air gaps that can lead to condensation and the removal of the insulation so you can see that the duct cross breaking is applicable between the two transverse joints of the duct and you can see also here one additional note ducts for four inch or more require no cross breaks or beds these are the recommendations of smacna regarding the duct